Gurbak Singh Preetlari was a Punjabi novelist and short story writer with more than 50 books to his credit. He is also considered the father of modern Punjabi prose and received Sahitya Akademi Fellowship, New Delhi in 1971, armed with an engineering degree from the Thomson Engineering College, now the IIT Roorkee. He also studied civil engineering at University of Michigan, Ann Arbor. Preet Nagar Gurbash Singh established Preet Nagar Township that was equidistant between Amritsar and Lahore. Gurbak Singh Preetlari, through his personal charisma, brought people like Balraj Sani, Nanak Singh, celebrity artist Soba Singh painter, and Dewan Singh, father of LT Gen Jagjit Singh Aurora of Bangladesh war fame, apart from associating Faiz Ahmad Faiz, Sahir Ludianvi, Apendra Nath Ashq and Kartar Singh Dugal, playwright Balwant Gargi, poets Mohan Singh and Amrita Pritam, the best talent of the time—with Preet Nagar. The great martyr Dewan Singh Kalapani, the great intellectual principal Tiha Singh, principal Jodh Singh were closely associated. Gandhiji was to visit here and Nehru did. Tagore was aware of it. Mulk Raj Anand, a renowned writer in English, said that Tagore's legacy was carried forward by four in India, and counts Gurbash Singh as one of these. He brought great solace and a sense of adventure to the just about upcoming middle class and would be professionals. Through his writings in the journal he founded in 1933, this journal, P R E E T L A R I or Linked Through Love, preceded the setting up of the township by five years. The township was in line with the international trend for intended communities. It had, among other efforts, a community kitchen, an activity based school called Activity School, a park, physical, artistic, political, economic activity, a team of Peace Corps, gatherings of like minds, theatrical activity, picnics, etc. Although Preet Nagar suffered a lot at the time of India's partition it is situated merely a few kilometres from the border that divides India and Pakistan and most of its inhabitants migrated to Delhi and other cities during those turbulent days, Gurbakh Singh and his family returned to live there with a few other families. In the mid-90s, two decades after Gurbakh Singh's death, a trust named Gurbakh Singh Nanak Singh Foundation was set up to restart cultural activities in Preet Nagar. A building was erected to host a library, an indoor conference hall and an amphitheater. Currently, under the chairpersonship of the eldest daughter of the writer, Uma Gurbakh Singh, plays are staged every month in the amphitheater to entertain and educate the local people. This tradition has been going on for the last ten years and Punjabi plays from all over the state as well as neighboring Pakistan have been performed there. Preet Lari To share his vision and philosophy of life with others, he started the monthly journal Preet Lari in 1933. The journal became so popular that Gurbakh Singh came to be known as Gurbakh Singh Preet Lari, although he himself never used this suffix as an author. During Gurbakh Singh's lifetime, from the 1950s his son Navtej Singh, a well-known writer himself, started co-editing the journal with his father and remained its editor until his own death in 1981. After the death of Navtej Singh, his son Sumit Singh aka Shami and Shami's wife Poonam continued to run the magazine. Shami was killed by Sikh fundamentalists as he wrote against extremism. The magazine is now run by Poonam Singh who is the editor and Radhi Kant Singh, Shami's younger brother and husband to Poonam Singh. Gurbakh Singh's son Herde Paul Singh edited, Bal Sandesh, the special children's magazine in Punjabi, also started by Sardar Gurbakh Singh. The journal Preet Lari carried translations, interpretations of Western thought, trends as well as sought to reinvent indigenous institutions in the same, i.e., modern light. The family members of Gurbash Singh sported his efforts and the next generation carried on the work during his lifetime and after. The magazine, once printed in four languages, and influencing the generations now in their late 70s in Pakistan, too, and going to many countries such as Thailand. That is, wherever Punjabis were settled, brought about a cultural revolution of sorts. It continues to run today and can be seen at Preetlari, WordPress, com, edited by Poonam Singh, his granddaughter-in-law and published by his grandson Radhi Kant Singh. <laughs> Gurbakh Singh Preetlari Award 
There is an award for Punjabi writer which is named as Gurbakh Singh Preetlari Award and given to many modern Punjabi writers such as Dalbert Chetan as mentioned in Who's Who of Indian Writers, 1999, AM Book.